Sun is out too. Thursday, September 1st, 2016, the Osman residence in Freeland. And we're going to be looking at some of the greatest costumes ever made. On a fine, beautiful day, a day that features Kitta. cat of complete peace and tranquility. <laughs> well, this is the original uh, Everything You Know Is Wrong applique. Of course, Tiny Tinica did all of these, uh, and they are really, really spectacular. Both of us chose, you know, fabrics and, and stuff. Here's the back side here. Very good, huh? Amazing. Oh, so good. Amazing uh, job. And so that's, there's Harpo, just wonderful Harpo there on the front. Who knows what this strange logo means? It has a little red spot. So that was the, those were the pants. This was uh, the hat, which is a little tight. It was always a little tight. And uh, this has. Um, well, I love the EC comics on that. It's got <laughs> 58, my uh, college class. It's got uh, Lake Placid, I don't know, you know, a wonderful pig, Blondie, all that's good. And then the jacket, this was the jacket that uh, was originally a jeans shirt, as you can see. Maverick, right? Maverick shirt. With just an incredible number, hundreds of pieces of... Let's turn around just a little bit so we can get the sun. Oh man. And really old pieces of fabric like this, you know, an invasion of, of Sacramento here. I mean, is that weird or what? <laughs> They're just weird. And nothing on here is, uh, I mean, this is all done in the early 70s. So some pieces are really ancient. Hollywood and Minnie Mouse. Wow. And what was there? George, of course. A buffalo. Elmer Fudd. Uh, Santa Barbara. The Santa Fe Railroad doesn't even exist anymore, right? Uh, here's a, here's a Huey, Dewey, and Louie. Donald Duck from the Second World War sometime. Uh, very nice rose. An embroidered Mixville rocket. That's a... Uh, Oh, Tiny yeah. embroidered that. Oh, and what a, and it's fully, and it's lined, you know. It's, this is all, this Aloha shirt is all lined inside. Back. So this was all done in, in time for that 1975 shoot. Yeah. Really a beautiful, beautiful piece of work. She also did this shirt, which is more of an... This was all like an Asian sort of look with the dragon on the front, the tiger, the dragon, and then the big dragon on the back. I think probably we had a, uh, you know, one of those Korean dragon jackets that was falling apart. But this is great, this inlay and all of these beautiful ribbon fabrics. This is all. Yep, yep, yep. And uh, that was never on an album cover. We did these, we did a lot of uh, tie dyeing in 71 uh, in, in that uh, upper Alvarado house. We, we were working for uh, 
company. And this was really, this was a spectacularly beautiful pair that I think I did, or we did them together, but who knows, you know, and it has these uh, motormen. <laughs> Motor man, man. The motor man buttons. <laughs> you button this up, you're the motor man. Yeah. yeah. And this is where tie dye was real. This is this is where it was at. You know, this was. Took you days to do this. There's none of them fit me anymore. That's why I'm not modeling. <laughs> and then on the road, this was the on the road uh, overalls. You know, to the the mic check overalls. So you've got Cummings and Cocteau and then all the states of course that we were touring in. This was 70, 1976 around the uh, the bicentennial so there's a lot of stuff on the top that's all bicentennial. The Freedom Train so forth. Those are all bicentennial. I have worn this since. Lick Dick in 72, that's a good one. And then we have this wonderful arm here. This is the Native American arm, Hopi. There, the crookedest street, Washington, Los Angeles. Kind okay, of classics there. The other arm. Yeah. Uh, very nice bear. Two very nice bears, actually. The blue red, blue red. These are really great patches, you know. Rodeo City is Washington State, Oregon, and of course the bear. <laughs> Being amazed by this golden uh, uh, thing at uh, Yellowstone, right? Golden geyser. <laughs> and then the back. It, this is souvenirs of Hawaii before, when nobody was talking about legalized pot. This was where that was going in the in the uh, mid-70s, all from Hawaii, that whole bunch. And, of course, the Stones, Rated X, and, and Let's Boogie. So I would wear this before the show. It was, uh, uh, you know, do the mic check and hang out. It has a performer on there. Airborne performer. Yeah. So I'll be right back with more. <laughs>